Tonight on 7 News Flashback, the tablet revolution. On this day, seven years ago, the first iPad went on sale in Australia, part of the ongoing digital revolution affecting our lives. Rod Young reports. Good morning. The revolution arrived like most others, from a guy dressed in jeans and a black turtleneck. And we'd like to show it to you today for the first time. And we call it the iPad. Bridging the gap between laptops and mobiles. Let me show it to you now. This is what it looks like. It went on sale in Australia on May 28, 2010. Long lines in Brisbane following the overseas hype. What is iPad? iPad is thin. iPad is beautiful. iPad goes anywhere and lasts all day. There's no right way or wrong way. It's crazy powerful. It's magical. You already know how to use it. I got a sense of history with this. This is a game changer. It was quickly replicated by other companies. A new way to read the newspaper, play games, watch movies and curate photos. It is the best browsing experience you've ever had. Soon it would become part of the workplace in all sorts of industries. Since its launch exactly seven years ago, more than 350 million iPads have been sold around the world. <laughs> Apple recognises St Hilda's School at Southport as one of Australia's iPad education pioneers. In one classroom, art, robots and drones, all tablet controlled. The things that the iPads bring to the table for us are mobility, um, students can learn anywhere, anytime and of course they're very creative devices. They've got so many tools that they can access with just a swipe, so we love them. And with the devices becoming even more powerful, the sky is the limit. I have no idea what's coming next but I'm on board. 